everybody, this is Randy Santel, Atlas, and I am very, very excited today. I'm going for overall win, number 925. I am back in Cape Coral, Florida. Today, I am here at La Mata's Pizzeria, an Italian restaurant. I'm hoping to become the first person to dominate their undefeated seven pound soprano sandwich challenge. Now, they do have a normal size soprano sandwich on their menu. This is super sized, like two to three times bigger, but I've got one hour to finish everything here. There is just so much on here to explain. There's literally like 10 or 15 different cold cut meats. Pretty much if it can go on an Italian sandwich, it's here. We've got some eggplant. I know there were pepperoncinis. All of the meats are by Jay Van Hart. Yes, here in the area. And then we've also got a ton of May's Legacy Sauce on here. It's more than just a sauce, and apparently from what I hear, I haven't tasted it yet. It goes on pretty much everything, but we've got this freshly baked Italian bread. We've got some healthy olives on top. So much food here, but we've also got cheeses. One of them was provolone, right? Yes. Yes, all right, so one hour to finish. If I fail, this is the craziest part, it's only $30, but if I win, I'll get my meal free, I'll get a sweet t-shirt, I'll get my name and photo up on the Wall of Fame, and I will get $50 cash. So let's get this challenge started. <laughs> All right, going for overall win number 925. I'm undefeated so far during this February Florida tour with Katina. Let's keep the streak going. Whew, I'm really excited to try this sauce. We do have as part of this event, Wicked Dolphin Vodka, but thankfully I don't have to chug this. One, two, three, boom. All right, and then big thank you to Carmelo, his family, everybody here at Lamada's for having me in to try this challenge. Let's take some of these Italian flags off and break this sandwich down layer by layer. If I get anything in my teeth, I've got more than enough toothpicks. Where is this bread from? Oh, okay, it's baked here. And then this is meat, I think, and then we got eggplant here. Ah, sliced meatball. That is good. The key to winning this is less water, so I'm gonna try to have as much as I can without taking any drinks. We've got lots of people here from representing May's Legacy Sauce, which is much appreciated. Let's try it out. Tastes very low calorie and very delicious. The low calorie was a joke, but it's worth it. All right, last bit of the eggplant that I know of. Yeah, the meatballs were good. A little bit sweaty, but they were delicious. No one can resist my sweaty balls. Five minutes in, couple of the meats and the eggplants down. Now we're on the sliced Italian sausage. I don't think I've ever had sliced Italian uh, cold cut sandwich. Everybody with May's Legacy Sauce made me an awesome sweet t-shirt. I'm gonna show you guys that towards the end. I've got it on now. Okay, we got ham, cheese, and some other stuff. Eventually, we're gonna get to the healthy vegetables. And like all these cold cuts, I think, are produced by J. Van Hart, which are delicious here in the area. This is a lot of meat, no doubt about that. We got some healthy onions coming up next. There's gonna be light at the end of the tunnel eventually, just not right now. Yeah. But thankfully, we have an hour. A lot of onions and pepperoncinis with these bites. If you like 
Italian food just moved down to Cape Coral because there is so much of it. That Amore Italian Bakery challenge was delicious. We've got this and then we have more coming up too, but just gonna keep on going. More onions coming up, we're gonna get it with this May's Legacy Sauce. I was worried they just kept stacking on. Carmelo's mother just started stacking on meats. And I was like, when are you guys gonna stop? And she just started laughing, but I'm feeling a little bit more confident now. Finish this last piece of meat. And then it, they came with a challenge, so I'm gonna finish these olives. Carmelo and the owners of May's Legacy Sauce have known each other for forever, right? Long time? Yeah, long time. We got 40 minutes to go, thankfully. I don't think we're gonna need it all, but time to enjoy this fresh mozzarella cheese with pesto sauce. I can't say I've eaten this many straight artichokes before. Gonna have like a whole field's worth of artichokes. Lots of healthy fats. I think I'm just gonna eat this as a sandwich. I don't wanna eat the bread all alone. Well, let's finish off the artichokes for shizzle. All right, I don't know how this is gonna work. Down to pretty much the peppers and healthy vegetables, lots of maize sauce, plus pepperoni and cheese. I think the Diet Pepsi is gonna help get the win. All right, less than 20 minutes to go. We gotta do this. <laughs> These jalapenos are actually gonna help get it all down just because of the difference in flavor and then there's like a whole liter of sauce on this, which is delicious. My editors, Magic Mitch and Arthur, hate editing short, easy videos, so I gotta make them longer for them. This was a whole lot of everything. 46 minutes, 30 seconds, almost there. Too many cameras are on me to get sick. <laughs> we are gonna beat 50 minutes. Thank you guys all for being here. <laughs> ah! First of all, I wanna say thank you to the challenge that I did last night. That was freaking huge at Pacific Counter. Without that, I don't know if I would have had the stomach space to get this down today, but that entire super size Soprano sandwich was amazing. I can't really say what meat was my favorite. There was like 15 to choose from. I love the cheeses on there. I think that's the, like the first time on a sandwich challenge I've had fresh mozzarella like that with the pesto sauce. That was delicious. The other cheeses were great. I enjoyed the bread with all of, and the big thanks to them for being part of all this. May's Legacy Sauce, Woo! that was delicious. If you're interested in getting any for yourself, 
uh, come to Lamada's where they have a special bottle or else you can contact them through the internet. The link is down in the description. But also thank you to Wicked Dolphin while watching Katina take on a spaghetti al forno challenge. I might have a drink with that, but that was such a delicious challenge. So thank you to Carmelo and his family here at La Mata's Pizzeria, an Italian restaurant here in Cape Coral, Florida, near Fort Myers, both in Southwest Florida, for the delicious supersized Soprano challenge for winning 49 minutes and 39 seconds I'm going to get my $30 sandwich for free, which is incredible, and it is a menu item, so if you're interested, even for your family, uh, come on in, but they also do have a muggle size version too. I'm also going to get a sweet t-shirt done to my collection, and I will have my name and photo up on the wall of fame. They are gonna throw in some of these fried Oreos. I might have those later. And I will also get, as part of one of their promotions, I'm gonna get $50 cash. So thank you guys all for being here. For me, it was overall win number 925. Tomorrow we'll be back up in the Tampa, Florida area for a cookie munchers challenge. Thank you guys for watching. Yeah.